Hi, this is Bino. Welcome back to my channel. This week what I wanted to do is talk about a two-in-one lanyard or a three-point lanyard. We built it a while back ago, but we really didn't talk about what it could do. So today what I wanted to do is just uh, show a little bit what it can do. Okay, so um, here's another lanyard that I um, changed out from my old loop pressic lanyard. So what I did is I used the two clips from the old other lanyard. They worked really well. Um, and then I did the double fisherman's eye knot and then connected to the the rope and this is a fly rope also the same kind of situation with uh, a pulley connected with a clip to a eye to eye French pressic and an English pressic is what I'm using um, a English pressic because the knot can move in two different ways um, it gets stuck in both ways and then on the other end the other clip from from the lanyard using the double fisherman knot so that's that's kind of well, what we did the video on, but we use actually Firefly and same same components. Everything was the same. A, a oval carabiner from Petzl. Um, today we'll I'll add this um, thimble pressic on the 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 side that I use that goes over a branch. So all you do to do that is just do an English pressic on it. Three wraps. So this this is a another component on it that's a, a real nice feature it'll help you do um, another type of tie-off so anyhow this is what we're gonna be using one of the points I wanted to make is this is a, a regular standard loop pressic lanyard and they're not really that long so if you wanted to do like say if you climbed a big tree and you're up in the canopy and say branches are like this large you you would have a it'd be kind of tough to uh, to get a to get a <laughs> around the tree I mean you, you can't reach so uh, with this double or two-in-one lantern you got a lot more length so you could uh, actually get around the tree and uh, if you needed to do you know have more you could you can work it just like a regular lanyard off of one side having that pulley with one action it's really pretty nice and the fact is you can work on big big stems so um, now that I got to my first point in the tree um, what's really cool about this system is that like say it was a conifer you could use um, two parts of the lanyard and kind of walk up the tree like a, a ladder in a way so what I wanted to show is how that works so I've already lanyard in now the next now what I'm gonna do is um, I'm gonna actually I'm gonna move my carabiner part to the center post. So here I'm gonna go to the center post. I'm gonna move it to the the sliding ring. And I'm gonna take off I'm gonna take off this pulley. Because what I don't want to do is if I'm going hand over hand and uh, when I uh, if I put my body weight in the pulleys here I could slide so what I'm gonna do is use one side here to go you know I'm already tied in and then the next one I'm gonna throw over and it'll lock me in so since I'm already tied in here I'm gonna loosen up my uh, my climbing line here okay with my quickie here okay now that I've taken this off I'm just gonna let it rest in front it's not gonna fall off because I got a quickie so I'm just gonna use my pressic right now got it kind of tight here and now with the other part of my lanyard 
I'm gonna clip into this side here. Okay, so now I'm gonna move up. And clip here. Now that I got a little higher, make my lanyard tight, okay? And now, with the other part, let me put my gloves on real quick, it'll be a lot easier. So now, I'll get the other part of the lanyard, and I'll advance it a little higher. Okay, now I'm clipped in here. I can undo this side. Let me set it here for right now. I can move higher. So now that I'm higher, tighten up my lantern. There you go. So one of the cool things you can do now, if this was a straight conifer tree or a tree with a bunch of branches, you could re really move all the way up to the top of the tree in that method. An another cool thing that you can do is, remember I was talking about that thimble. So if you were walking out on a branch and just say it was really kind of far out and, you know, like this branch is already bowing and you're kind of getting nervous. Well, what you could do is get that thimble, have your... Have it connected to the center post with your carabiner, the middle part. You get your uh, you get your thimble and you there you go. What you do is you connect to your thimble, and now what you have is a a little choking action where you can get it almost just like a if you were doing a, a DDRT kind of a situation. So it kind of takes the weight off of the branch you're on. And what's kind of cool is now you can go out further and if you were to slip you're only going to go up as far as this is going to go so you wouldn't have to you know just say it was a real far branch um, it's a nice um, option to have this uh, choking thimble here and then when you want to go back in you just kind of do it as if you were doing a, a double rope kind of pull it and then to bring it off, you just unhook a little. Connect it back to your belt and you're ready to, to go back in. So another thing I wanted to show you was, um, so we're still set up with the center post and one on either side and I've taken off the pulley because I don't want to slide. So say I wanted to reach a branch and uh, it was kind of far and I was feeling uncomfortable say I'm like at the top of a tree somewhere and and the top is kind of like iffy and I'm just being tied here it makes me nervous I could go around also another branch and and connect to myself so now I have another a point of attachment where now I, I feel more secure like if they were really kind of skinny branches and I felt I like needed some um, you know to be more secure this is also another way you can do it well that was what you can do a few of the things that you can do with a two-in-one lanyard um, I, I like it the the part where it's a little bit bigger so you can go over larger branches I mean in length I'm also having it where you can go up a tree by clipping in and clipping out. That's a real cool option. And even that uh, having that thimble, the Presic thimble, and you can tie in almost do like a double crotch kind of a situation. That's a nice um, thing that you can do. And the last thing where you can use two parts of the lanyard and being connected in the center, undoing your pulley, and you have a little bit more security like if you're on some small branches. So there you go. Well, that was a video on the two-in-one lanyard or a three-point lanyard. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Comment, like, subscribe. 
And if you want to see what we do, the content that we put out, hit that notification bell. Also, if you know people who might like tree stuff, tree things, share our videos. Take care. See you next time.